Welcome, Bills Mafia. That was a really bad freaking loss. I got ridiculed on, on one of my videos about Sean McDermott saying I was crazy for thinking he should get fired. I'm sorry, but there's no excuse for what's been going on lately. I mean, he's he's a poor man's freaking Marv Levy. Marv Levy was not a good coach. You young guys, oh, he's a legend. A legend of what? Losing four straight Super Bowls and he had the best roster? One of my good friends, I remember after the Bills all lost a fourth straight Super Bowl, he sends me a, a letter saying, oh, God, Marv Levy sucks moose cock once again. And I agree with him. I mean, I'm sorry. I, it, it, Sean McDermott is not as good a coach as you think he is. He's got a great roster. He will not confront Josh Allen about the turnovers. That's a third straight week. Third straight week where you turn the ball over in the red zone. That's unacceptable. Sean McDermott says, well, he knows that. Obviously, he doesn't because he keeps doing it. I don't want to hear, you know, him saying, well, it's on me. We'll do something about it. Go in game film and say, what the hell was that all about? I mean, you're a freaking almost a 13-point favorite and you lose? Yeah, it's, there is no excuses. I'm sorry, Bills fans, but I got to tell you, I know you don't want to hear this, but the Bills ain't winning the Super Bowl. Not with this coach. They're going to have to get rid of him. He's just not that good. He, he, you cannot assume that the guy knows. You got to confront him right on the sidelines about these poor turnovers. Bill Belichick would do that with Brady when he missed the throw this and that. He doesn't do anything. If he doesn't confront him on the sidelines, it means he probably doesn't even bring it up in film study. Now, now they got another tough matchup. Yeah, they're at home, but they're playing Minnesota. I'm sorry, but they ain't going to win the Super Bowl. Not with Sean McDermott. I'll be really surprised if they do. He's just he's just not that good. They got the best roster. That's what it is. Last couple of games, Josh Halloran hasn't played real well. He doesn't say anything to him. And the reason why he keeps screwing up at times because Sean McDermott doesn't even let him know there's something wrong. I worked in a grocery store. That's like saying, well, Bill knows he's got to do better. When the aisle's a mess, how do I know you're not pointing it out? Same thing, point out the fact that the, he's got to stop turning the ball over, especially in the red zone. Every freaking time they get in the red zone now, I'm afraid they're going to turn the ball over. They stink in the red zone, and it comes down to coach. I'm sorry, it does. For, it's been like four years in a row where they had problems with flags. They finally cleaned that up. Sean McDermott never said anything about that either, even in the press conferences. So I'm sorry, Bills fans, but the building going to win the Super Bowl. They're just not the way they're playing. I don't want to sound negative, but Sean McDermott's not the answer. I'm telling you. He'll find a way to screw it up. You get your hopes up, and then, then they'll do something really stupid. Oh, I'm sorry. You cannot lose to the Jets. And I, I'm not, and I knew the Jets. I, I was talking to a good friend of mine who's a real Jet fan today. And he was like, oh, you know, I, I think the Bills are going to beat him convincingly. You know, Bills high-powered offense. I go, no. I go, I told him. I said, point black. I go, I would be happy if the Bills at least win the game. I go, I would, don't be so sure that the Jets won't pull this one out. And sure enough, I was right. I've seen this over and over with Marv Levy. A game they should win and look like they would be a great team. And next thing you know, they, they screw it up. I remember with Jim Keller, the same thing. It's like, what the hell? You're supposed to be a better team and you guys come out flat. So they gotta, they're going to have to clean that up. But the, saying they have to clean it up, they haven't cleaned it up. So I'm not confident they will. They turn the ball over way too many times. It's getting out of control. This time, it t cost them the game. You know, they always have to wait till, till they actually lose the game to say something. No. Against Kansas City, you pulled it out so you don't say anything. I don't care. You, you turn it over in the red zone there on a fumble. Guy was on the same page. I'm like, well, are you guys even studying anything or paying attention? Well, that's my thoughts on it. Please hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification. And please leave your comments. And go, Bills!